first of all, uh, we are talking about something, but uh, nowadays you are working so hard. Uh, there was an interesting event in the previous day, Rotafall O. Yeah. Uh, it was interesting because uh, it is focused on Rotogravit. Yeah. Uh, would you say something about Rotafall O? Yeah, sure. Thank you very much for, 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 for the question. Um, I, I said just uh, before that we, we are facing a, a different situation from the usual one. All over the world, worldwide, there is this uh, new situation. And we decide to, uh, make, to switch to a, a digital, it means a physical and uh, remote uh, events, just to focus on these technologies because we built up last year a rotogradual group here in Italy uh, because Acinga is the association representing technology for printing and converting. Uh, it means that we represent whatever, what technology, uh, whatever technology, uh, it means flexographic, it, it means uh, rotogradual, it means digital. Uh, even if in Italy we have only one uh, producer's uh, digital, which is uh, Tourst, you know, and the other one are uh, country uh, from uh, international companies as HP and like Xerox uh, and so on. And we represent in any case offset too uh, with, the same, uh, with the same concept. So uh, flexographic and photographic has its own uh, market, its own technology production here in Italy. Uh, the other one, they only have countries that manage EMEA market or the only Italy. But in any case, Achinga represents all of those, uh, as well represent converting all the converting technologies uh, uh, in, in Italy. So, uh, concerning the, the uh, te printing technology, uh, we build up a group, Rotogravo, the Italian Rotogravo group, because we have uh, a good asset uh, as uh, know-how here in Italy for Rotogravo, at uh, know-how and production. That's the reason why we build up this, uh, this group and we make, uh, uh, we program the first uh, event in March and we, uh, we were in totally lockdown, but in any case, we organize a, a webinar uh, during that period when our company uh, was uh, continuing the production because we made a lot of lobby actions to uh, the government. So the ATECO code, it means the codes uh, in registry in the Chamber of Commerce uh, of Achinga continued to, produce, to make the, the production of the, of the technology during the lockdown, so it was a, a big successful goal from Achim. In any case, during the lockdown we made this webinar and we uh, postponed the physical event to uh, October. As you can see, as we can see, we face, and the, 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 the project was physical, it means uh, uh, remote and physical. We cancelled the physical moment because of a new uh, rule from government was uh, to suspend all the activities uh, physical and so we uh, make only the webinar part with the same agenda of, uh, of what uh, was programmed and we make we 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 bring there uh, brand owners printers converters as well uh, as uh, university professor, as well as uh, expert in sustainability, as well as uh, expert in printing and converting technology manufacturing, so the companies. Uh, just to talk about uh, of the case histories and trends for Rotogravio, which uh, till that moment uh, had not an Italian platform to communicate and to make advocacy for all over the world. And I think this is a, a first brick to a long-term project to build up around the Italian know-how, uh, the right uh, communication program uh, 
uh, on Rotogradio. We will build up other vertical focus in Cilia. We have in program to make a focus in tissue and non, non water. Uh, the strategy of Acilia is uh, to uh, focus different technologies because they are different markets. You know? Exactly. Exactly. Okay, uh, let's talk about our main subject. Uh, you have another event uh, next month, 4th November, uh, especially for Turkey. Uh, Future Factory is streaming uh, roadshow. What is the main purpose of this event? Yeah, thank you very much, and uh, uh, I, I will preview to the to the to the follower that uh, there will be uh, Mappa Technique Two in there because we would like to uh, invite that to be part of this uh, Rimigro show. It will be next fourth November in Turkey because Achinga. Um, we, we change all the international activities in a webinar activity, you know, uh, and we focus, uh, first of all, Turkey, Algeria, uh, Egypt and UK for this uh, last part of 2020. We organize a streaming roadshow in there with all the supply chain talking about uh, the trends of the printing and converting uh, sectors. Uh, printer and uh, brand owners will, and editors will be local and uh, some speakers from Italy uh, as uh, representing, compa representing companies of printing and converting technology manufacturing. So it will be a sort of bridge between two different uh, uh, cultures, two different markets, two different countries, uh, just to talk about and to focus about sustainability and industry 4.0. Because uh, we think that the product communication is something like to the trade fairs, you know, is not something like advocacy and meeting between different systems, different cultures, different markets. We have to talk about vision, we have to talk about strategy, about two trade topics as sustainability and industry 4.0 as the and for as the element of the supply chain interactions you know uh, a special question why turkey what is the size of trade between italian and turkish uh, packaging industries you know yes something? yes yes uh, turkey is very important to uh, for for italy uh, machinery production in printing and converting sector because of uh, we uh, export in 2019, so last year we exported uh, 235 billion, million euro, sorry, not, not billion, million euro uh, in printing and converting technology. Um, 2020 is a strange year, as you know, uh, but we were off, uh, even we continue to production uh, follow the, the, the order because we, uh, Achinga members, uh, build up technology as uh, starting from New York, you know, is a build to order uh, forecast, production forecast. Uh, they build up the technology only when there is an order signed up with technology and specific technology from the, from the customers. So uh, we, they, uh, they forecast six, six months uh, of production since the order. So, uh, we continue to produce uh, in, 2000, in 2020 with the orders of 2019. But the first part of the year, we have no decline in exporting in Turkey as well. We have no decline in exporting in other countries. Okay? The decline will, was, in, in terms of production, was at the beginning of September, after the break, after the, the, the summer break, if you want. Uh, September, October and October was very good, good in order to keep the game order from worldwide markets. And now we are facing a new stock as a forecast till the end of 2020. So 2020 is a strange year, uh, talking about orders and uh, uh, turnovers in the companies. So we, we, we forecast uh, in terms of value of production, because this is the first year that I remember that our companies has a, a, a 
in, 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 the, in, the, in the balance sheet they have uh, warehouse, they have stock, okay? They have stock of machines. So we forecast uh, less uh, 12% of downsizing uh, in, uh, uh, on 2019, at the end of 2020. Uh, in any case, uh, Turkey is one of the 10th uh, most important markets for Italy. So it is ranked the 10th in, uh, in, uh, for the export of printed converted machinery from Italy to the rest of the world. And you can, uh, I have to say that 60% of the exportation is uh, on Europe. So uh, Turkey is one of the most important countries, ranked third as market outside Asia. Uh, I have um, one more question. Uh, we talked uh, with you for this event before this uh, interview. Uh, you said me not made in Italy, made by yeah. Italy. Yeah. What is the difference? Yeah, okay. that's that's the, the, the focus point of our of our of our activities because the, the markets are global. Even the, the companies are global, they think global. They collect uh, different culture, different organization, different supply chains. So we cannot talk about made in Italy because every single product, not only in our se sector, is made by something that coming from outside. You know? This is the, 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 the global market. This is, we are in the global market. We have no uh, idea, there are no borders if we talk about money, because companies, products are made by different uh, approach, different uh, uh, um, culture, different uh, supply chain, as I told you, uh, whatever. So we talk about made by Italy because of this contain this concept. This is not made in Italy, this is made by Italy, even from the companies that uh, keep the money in the other countries because the supply chain and the, the, and the, and the properties nowadays are totally, totally globalized, you know? So the concept that, that is that in Italy we have a culture about printing and converting technology manufacturing, uh, but this culture is made by financing or made by other countries at the same time. We collect these different items in a different way, in an Italian way, if you want. That's the reason why made by or by Italians, if you want, or whatever. But in any case, made in is something that is too much bureaucratic. It's not a, 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 a mirror of the globalization, you know? This is a uh, philosophy, I liked it. Thank you. And uh, we will see you again next week uh, for Streaming Roadshow. Uh, but what will be the next step for uh, 2021? Uh, yes, we, as you know, uh, we organize a trade fair called uh, Prim for All. Prim for All is a new trade fair project. The first edition was in 2018 with uh, uh, Innovation Alliance project. I mean, uh, it was co-located with uh, Ipakima dosing and filling machines and was co-located with Plast, uh, all the machines for the plastics. Uh, so we try to make a, a sort of a, a show uh, in a machinery supply chain. You know, you have all the machinery for the material, plastic and some paper. You have the printing and converting. You have dosing and filling. So all the supply chain is represented by uh, Innovation Alliance. It was a print for all, specifically it was a success. Uh, we, we had uh, 35,000 uh, unique visitors just for print for all, uh, for the fifth edition. We move uh, uh, print for all from 2021 because of uh, Drupa moved and we, we the next edition will be in 2022. 
uh, 4th, 7th May with Ipakino because Plus uh, keep the dates of 2021 for, for K, okay, for the calendar about uh, K in, in Dusseldorf. And uh, when we, uh, in the years that uh, when there is no the trade fairs, when there is no print for all, uh, we organize print for all conference, which uh, usually is uh, uh, physical. We made uh, a webinar version in June. We had uh, 1,300 uh, uh, registered companies, registered people from uh, uh, international companies. Yes, it was huge and successful. And we are going to organize the same for the March 2021. I hope and we hope that we, we, we will be able to organize physical, but in any case, if not, there will be another webinar, you know, because uh, we would like to bring their contents, not only networking, but content, visionary content, strategical content from the entire supply chain. This is, for us, the right approach to uh, grow the sector, grow the culture, and grow the commercial activities too. Because uh, if you uh, talk about all the products, I think you are not serving uh, the, your market. You have uh, more and more to give uh, services to your customers. And to give services, you have to understand which is the forecast and trends for the future, you know? You have to solve problems. You have no, not to sell technology. Technology is something like to the service. That's the reason why we work a lot with the Industry 4.0. That's good. I hope uh, you can help it uh, as physically next year. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. This, this means COVID goes out uh, from our world. Yeah, I yeah. So. I, we yeah. hope. I, me too, me too. Absolutely. I want to hear your main message for Turkish printers and their converters about uh, next week's streaming workshop. Perfect. Okay. Thank you very much. Yes, we we What's see, your... we 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 are going to see there, and I think uh, it will be a good uh, uh, moment to understand the international trends. About uh, uh, is something light, light uh, to a, a sort of out of the box thing. You have uh, we have to talk about sustainability industry 4.0 as the element of uh, the evolution of the market. We have to talk about this and not specifically of uh, the product. So we wait for you there, all the supply chain, all the tar Turkish supply chain, and uh, this is uh, uh, the first approach to a follow-up uh, content meeting, follow-up uh, mail, follow-up uh, whatever, to grow up together the, culture line between the printing and converting, packaging, labeling and whatever application. We tried and we are trying to make a, a system. So uh, we involved the uh, Italian Trade Commission, which is a, a partner, an important partner to organize that locally. And we involved the Ministry of Foreign Affairs because now uh, Italian Trade Commission depends from the Ministry of international trade affairs in Italy. They reorganized it. So I think that the most important is that all the system, representing system, public, and the representing system, private, as a Chinga, Confindustria, will be together joined just to pass the catch, you know, uh, and uh, making bridge with the different countries. Thank you very much, Andrea, for your time. Thank you. Thank you very much for this interview. I'll see you next week. I hope see you.